Right, okay, so we are down at Araka, something like that. I'm sorry, I think I've butchered it. But anyway, what we are planning on doing today with this one that's come running over now, got the little goo. Uh, yeah, we've got my partner and my mum with us as well. Basically, what we're going to be doing is climbing. The trees are in the way, but basically, we're climbing up a Monroe. So it's going to be higher than that there. Basically, a Monroe, it's got to be over how tall? Oh, she remembered something, yes, the Monroe. So it's basically a mountain, it's got to be over 3,000 feet um, to be actually classed as, as a Monroe. I think there's about 250 or so in Scotland. And we are going to go and do our very first one today. So this one's pretty popular, I think. But what we've got to do is basically just start a track and it just goes straight up. And that is pretty much it. Uh, so hopefully it's going to be a good journey. Hopefully we're going to see some absolutely fantastic views. I am hoping the sun does get covered in clouds at some point because it does make it a little bit hazy trying to take pictures or whatnot else. But are we going to have fun anyway? Yeah. And what's she eating again? Lives on crisps. Right, okay. Uh, as you can see, everyone's just having a little break now. It's not really the height that we're actually walking up. It's really, really close today, like really sticky. How hot is it today, isn't it? Very hot. It is really sticky today, very humid. But I suppose it's better than that and it raining, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. But anyway, so as you can see, this is how high we have climbed. Now, we've got to get up and round that. Now, that is not the peak. That is not the peak. I know some people get excited when they go walking and they think, oh! There it is there, it's not. So we've got to get over that and then uh, keep going, don't we? And I think then what we're going to do is we're going to turn this into a circular walk and we're going to come back down through the cobblers on the way back down to have a look at that as well. What is up with that? Right, as you can see, we've climbed a little bit higher. Higher we got, that seems to be the highest one. It just seems to be a lot of steps. But like I say, I mean, I think it's a lot easier the fact that we're going straight up rather than a really long trail, adding loads of extra miles on the winding way. So I kind of prefer it this way, so it's not too bad. But hopefully, once we get to that bridge there, it should then descend and then um, Ben near, is it Ben near? Oh, I'm terrible with remembering names. But hopefully that will be in the background. As you can see, the views are opening up absolutely spectacularly. So should be really nice just from this top there. Right, Whew. we made it at the top of there. It's just loads of steps, man, and it is very close indeed, but we've made it and I gotta say, what a magical, magical set. And we're not even at the top yet. Uh, we've got, still got a little bit to walk yet. But I can say, as you're going to see coming up right now, it's some absolutely stunning views. Right, as you can see, absolutely stunning. Right, so behind me, right directly behind me, that's thing called the Cobblers, it might be absolutely beautiful. There is a path, a main path, that's going all the way up there, uh, up to the actual Cobblers. So what we need to do is we need to head over this side and climb up around there. And there should be like a path that should go around there up to the actual Monroe that we're climbing. And then what we are gonna do is gonna come back through the Cobblers and back down through that path all hoping that does go to plan. Right, as you can see, we we're scrambling out that bit. We got up there. Yeah, we got another one to go yet. It's not too bad. Scramble's a bit of a it's a bit hard in places, but it's not too bad. 
Views are getting more spectacular as we're going on, as you can see. But all we've got to do now is just keep climbing and hopefully we'll get to the end. Right, okay, so we just reached the, the next little bit. Now, it does go down a little bit, then we gotta climb up that. So basically there is a very, very thin trail leading up the side of that. <laughs> How thin is the trail going up the very side? Very thin, it's like the, like that there. Yeah, so we're gonna have to really take care if we don't go sliding down the mountain, so. Yeah, no one would be a bandy, especially me. No, yes, yeah, so this one here likes to fall over all the time, so. Fingers crossed she doesn't go sliding down because otherwise we're just going to leave her. Yeah, we'll just leave her to the sheep otherwise. I but anyway. Oh? Well, they'll find you. Right, let's go. Right, as you can see, we've just got that bit now where we scrambled up. Views are spectacular once again. Obviously, you can see how much it changes the higher you get, and it is getting incredible. Now, the only thing is, what we got is that in the background there. Now, apparently, we just got to go over that, and the last section is pretty easy going. How's it been so far for you, though, Gooby? Good. She's enjoyed it. How's, how do you think Grandma's gone? She's close to the edge, I think Grandma is. Yeah. Well, honestly, I think. I think I think we're gonna end up leaving her here soon. <laughs> no, she is, yeah, she's struggling a bit because there's a lot of scrambling and that lot. Uh, but we are mostly at the top. So once we get out, that is the cobblers over there, as you can see, which is a little bit higher. Uh, apparently we are gonna take the path through there. Now, I, well, the bit that grandma doesn't realize, right? Yeah. Is the path, right, goes through the center of that great big man, which means we gotta go downhill then up so keep that a secret from Gamma. Gamma okay, otherwise she might she might just go crazy, okay? <laughs> <laughs> right, so we're gonna have a quick drink here and then we are gonna get to the peak. Yeah. Let's do it. Right, okay, so that is going to be the end of it. Uh, we are going to be heading down this track here, but apparently we'd have to go at the cobbler and that, and we are going to give uh, my, my mum a bit of a rest because otherwise she might get a bit tired. So we are going to do the cobbler another time, and we are going to uh, do the uh, Monroe a second time. But to be fair, we have promised my partner that she's going to get oysters. So if we can get out of here on time, she might be able to get oysters. She's, look, she's, she's over there, look, she's cheering at the moment, so she's Midgies. open. So yeah, we're gonna go and do that now. Plus we are getting eaten alive by midges because they seem to be everywhere. So it's a good time to end this video now. Uh, tomorrow we're gonna be going back out once again. Uh, I'm not too sure where we're going tomorrow. I think a road trip tomorrow. Less mountains, I think, tomorrow. But beautiful views. See you then. <laughs>